Yeah, so tired. Just yeah. Mm. I'm starting to think that this 7:45 meeting on Wednesdays is like a weekly thing now. This is the third week in a row I've been here so early. I almost didn't make it this time, but I did. And I learned stuff, which was the point of going. Another opportunity to become painfully aware of just how much there is that I don't know about the product I write about. Fortunately, you don't have to actually know stuff. You just have to be able to look at something and say, is that right? And then ask someone who does know, and then they go, oh, no, good catch. I have, let me see if I can find it. I, I tried doing it yesterday. Maybe it's behaving now. But I have, no, there it is. Can you see it? Can you see it? It's right here. This hair of my eyebrow is pointing straight up. Like it's one of these kind of, it's now 4.38 p.m., I don't know what it's called when you have eyebrows that, that curl up so early like that, you know? Like in the monster movie? But I have like one hair like that. It's so creepy. But I can't cut it or pull it out. Because I just can't do it. But it, whenever I'm in the bathroom, I'm washing my hands, I'm looking at the mirror, and that hair, sticking straight up, mocks me. <sighs> or maybe sleep deprivation is making me all funny. I don't know. Uh, it is 4.38 p.m. The current temperature is 58 degrees. Ah, gorgeous weather. It's so cloudy, though. You feel like it's going to rain at any moment, and then it doesn't. So, because it's early and I'll have a couple hours, there's a good chance that I will get the lawn mode. Although, I may be going to a trivia night. I'm not sure. It's one of those deals where uh, a friend asked if Kim and I wanted to go, but Kim's working until 9, so I'm not sure it's cool if I go by myself. It'd see a little weird. On the other hand, I'm I'm a helper when it comes to the trivia. I'm not as useful as Kim is, though. Having Kim on your team is an automatic win. She's better at retaining knowledge. I'm better at forgetting things, but knowing how to look them up very quickly. She can't do that in a trivia contest. I need some more caffeine. Uh, hang on just a minute. Ah, sorry for that. You guys are responding to the not newest YouTube thread, so it's confusing me when I click on the, the one with the most recent reply, and it's the old one. Because you're all having your own conversations without me, which is totally not the point of me having this uh, deal. Alright, it's a comment from Mike. Mike suggests me going to the attic now, getting the air conditioner, bringing it down, but not actually installing it, but just having it there nearby. So the next time it gets hot, I just have to put it in the window. I don't think I saved that much time by doing it. It's not a matter of it's too hot for me to go to the, up into the attic, although the attic does get kind of toasty, but it's just, I don't know. It, it, it's no big deal whether I go up and down that flight of stairs now or later. It's a pain either way. So it's really one of those things I'm just more likely to not do until the absolute last moment when it must be done to avoid subjecting myself to that kind of physical exertion uh, as long as possible. You know what I need? I need some forklift arms because those families, they lift huge pieces of furniture with their kids on top of them. And a disclaimer on the screen saying, never lift people. Have you seen those ads? Forklift arms? I think they're forklift arms. How sad for me that I now feel an immediate need to type in forkliftarms.com, which doesn't work. So that's not what it's called. Like hand bands. I don't know. Well, they are called forklift arms. Well, if you import them, they are. Now I'll have to see that stupid ad again so I can see if it's got a website or not. What's wrong with me? It's the first game of the Stanley Cup tonight. LA Kings versus New Jersey Devils. Uh, go Kings? 
I guess. Uh, I don't know. Who's the higher seed? Kings are an eight seed, aren't they? That'd be pretty cool to have an eight seed win the cup, though, so maybe I should root for the Kings. My ex-roommate, who, whose wife watches. Hi, Cheryl. Rich was the biggest Sharks fan in the world. I believe I've told you this before as well. Rich is the biggest Sharks fan in the world when I knew him. But it's like I don't know him now because he's the biggest Kings fan in the world. All because he lives close to where the Kings play. I mean, that's a dumb reason to like give up on a team. Oh, wait. I did that to the Sacramento Kings, didn't I? Hey, the draft lottery's tonight, too. Ping pong balls, ping pong balls. They never show up to us because it's fixed. Which means the number one pick will go to whoever the Wolves traded their pick to. Uh, the Hornets. The Hornets have a 1.1% chance, and they will defy the odds and get that pick because the Wolves are cursed that way. But it's going to be weird going into a draft lottery. This will be the first one since I became a Wolves fan that, you know, we're not in that top seven and have some remote chance of being number one. I tell I'm running purely on caffeine because I'm very chatterboxy. Oh, I was afraid you were going to say that. Just got an email. Without really saying anything, and yet better at filling the time than I was, say, yesterday. Oh, that reminds me. I did get some comments on yesterday, but they were left before the commenter watched the video. I'm thinking specifically of Pie Man here. Oh, I have a Facebook message, too. Man, I'm popular. Let me find my comment now. Let me find Greg's comment, actually. I do appreciate the like, though. Hey, if you like this on Facebook, actually, if you just watch this on Facebook, you don't even have to actually like it per se, but you can capital L like it on Facebook. Once again, I'm going to like this first and then watch it. I'll bet you regret that decision. Let us be the judge of boring, sir. You're too polite to actually say it's boring. You all are. You just stop watching. I don't know that for sure either. As I go to YouTube to look up my numbers. Oops, I'm not signed in. Well, I, I got a new keyboard today. It's like an old keyboard. The keyboard I had was that washable one. But this key right here, the pipe key, it's not where it should be on the keyboard I used to have. What happened was when I changed laptops, I could no longer plug in the PS2 style plug, so I had to get a USB keyboard. But the layout was wrong, so my finger was always in the wrong spot. And I happened to find this one today. I had to replace my monitor over here. So you can actually see that. There was the old monitor, you couldn't see it at all. It was like it was on, but it had no power. You could see nothing. So while I was picking up that monitor, uh, a guy who took a position in the other building and left it behind, and because it, these monitors are actually really hard to find now because they're old and obsolete, so we all have kind of flat screen uh, LCD type things, so there aren't any big honking CRTs that you uh, hook up to your Unix box. While I was there, I found a keyboard, a USB keyboard with the style I like, so now I'm like trying to unlearn what I had been relearning, reteaching myself. Video manager. So, poor Pinky, he's so confused. But at least now it matches, once again, Every keyboard I have has this set, which most of the Macs I have too, so. You wouldn't think that I would use Pipe that much, but yeah, I am still a Unix guy, even with all these Macs at home and running this Windows laptop. Hey, my numbers are steady. I haven't offended too many of you. Ironically, the ones that I've blocked, the ones that have blocked content have more. Why is that? I don't know. Because somehow it must match that the song that it matches must draw people in somehow and then they realize it has nothing to do with the song and they go away well that's it for me let's see if I'm going out tonight or not I am fine with just you and me if you don't mind well uh, I'm gonna go cheat on my wife no I'm just kidding it's my wife's good friend so that'll be cool uh, and hopefully we'll win the trivia. So I'll have something to talk about tomorrow, which will be my last day of the week. Thank you for watching uh, tonight. My ten minutes is up. And um, I'm that guy. Thanks for watching one more time.